Here are some of the strangest things created for rich people to buy. Number 9. Midas Touch Have you guys ever had the urge to light money on fire? Well, instead of doing that, you can just buy gold staples. Yes, gold staples for over a hundred bucks is a thing. 118 bucks to be exact. I guess rich people still stuck in the 20th century sometimes really need to impress people whenever they staple their papers together. I mean, how do bosses feel whenever they see some TPS report with a gold staple up on the left corner? Oh wait, rich people often are their own bosses, so it's probably the other way around. But really though, how often would gold staples be useful to show off as a status symbol? Maybe it's useful to staple some tattered designer clothing together, or just about anything as the website suggests. If solid gold staples are a thing, then why hasn't anyone started working on solid gold staplers? Who wants to use gold staples for our regular old staplers? Oh, wait, they already do! <sighs> Anyways, the gold staples are, or were, created by Assembly New York, as we can't access nor find their site anymore. Is this a good thing for the world? Probably. What's the most ridiculous thing you've seen someone do to try to show off? Let us know in the comment section. Number 8. Luxury Teeth Yeah, we get that there are some toothpastes that work better than other ones out there, but is there really a $95 or so difference between a standard toothpaste and this luxury toothpaste? That's what Theodent wants people to believe. Theodent 300 sells for almost 100 bucks for a 3.4 ounce tube. This toothpaste has a patented ingredient called Renault, which is a non-toxic proprietary blend of a naturally occurring extract found in cocoa plants blended with other minerals. Supposedly it helps to strengthen the enamel surface of teeth. Somehow this substance actually helps to stimulate the growth of new enamel. If this is true, then it's worth the price. Maybe. Do we need to say that paying a hundred bucks for a paste that you rub against your teeth and then spit out seems a bit extravagant? Does it actually work? Well, it looks like there's been only one clinical trial, a double-blinded study of 80 patients that was funded by Theodent, and a few similar studies also funded by Theodent. <laughs> yeah, this product's effectiveness isn't exactly proven beyond a doubt. Conflict of interest, anyone? Number 7. Expensive Bubbles Does anyone actually need a crystal bathtub? That's the question we'd like to ask Tamara Ecclestone daughter of the British billionaire and former boss of Formula One, Bernie Ecclestone. She spent over a million bucks to get a custom-made crystal bathtub. Yes, there are crystal bathtubs out there. This particular bathtub was made by the Italian company Baldi. Baldi is known for its use of precious and semi-precious stones in their bathroom collections. They use materials such as aquamarine, tiger's eye, amethyst, and rock crystals. Baldi sculpted the three-person rock crystal bathtub with diamond cuts, but the tub's edges were left partially rough to enhance the natural elegance of the crystal. Tamara said that the reason it cost so much wasn't only because of the materials, but also because of the labor involved in creating the tub. She justified her spending by saying that she took a ton of baths. Somehow, in the same breath, she also wanted to speak on the attitude her and her sister have toward money. She said that her dad raised her and her sister to appreciate money and to not take it for granted. Hey, if that's not self-awareness, then what is? Number 6. Obsolete Bling When you have too much money in the bank, some people want other people to know it. One way to show that you have too much money is by having a custom decorated phone. Plenty of companies have made phones that are expensive, but back in 2014, luxury company Falcon took it to another level. They created an iPhone 6 with a pink diamond on the back, priced at $48.5 million. Apparently no one in their right mind bought one, because seriously, just why would they? We're kinda surprised Mayweather didn't buy one though, since he recently bought an $18 million watch called the Billionaire Watch. Okay, so no one went for a phone that's almost 50 million. How about an $8 million iPhone 4 that's still somehow for sale on luxury website Stuart Hughes? 
No one bought this back in the day, and we're pretty sure no one's gonna buy that in the future. It's not just phones, either. If you just browse through the website, you'll see just about anything electronic can be made with gold and precious stones. You can find gold and diamond encrusted things like laptops, gaming systems, and headphones. Really, it seems like this company will gold plate pretty much anything you want them to. Number 5. Crocodile Everything Billionaire Couture is a luxury brand founded by business mogul Flavio Briatore and designer Angelo Galasso. So, other than the usual expensive clothes, what else did they come together and create? Well, they came out with the most expensive umbrella in the world, because why not? Made entirely of black top grade crocodile skin treated for water resistance, this umbrella costs 50 grand. Briator wanted to start a line of clothing and accessories that was exclusively for guys like him. We're gonna guess rich here. Every item is handmade in Italy in limited quantities, and is the result of, quote, obsessive research into fabrics, materials, and details. Fans of the line include Paul McCartney, David Beckham, and Diddy. In addition to the umbrella, Billionaire Couture also features crocodile bags, shoes, and coats, and a variety of other precious and exotic materials. Each piece is characterized by, quote, a relentless search for original details that express quality, sophistication, and eccentricity. Which, Briatore and Galasso freely admit, at times goes intentionally overboard. Number 4. Blending Dreams Have you seen the Will It Blend videos? It's essentially where the founder of the appliance company Blendtec blends random things. Everything from deodorant to smartphones. No wonder they came out with the Blendtec Smoother Q series. This blender isn't just powerful. Its sound enclosure and muffled motor stand ensure that it's also quiet. Who wouldn't want a heavy-duty blender doing its job quietly in the mansion? The blender can even be built into your countertop to reduce its height by 8 inches. If you love juicing, this blender can be yours for just a little under 1200 bucks. However, for people who are really serious about blending, they've got to check out the, the Mega, Mega Blender. Blender. The Mega Blender was the most expensive blending appliance that was offered by Blendtec at over $20,000 at the time. This frozen beverage dispensing master was huge, although it can probably be custom built into some rich person's kitchen. The refrigerated system featured pumps that can dispense six different ingredients on call. It also features a monitoring system that keeps track of the ice and ingredient levels. Must be nice. Number 3. Nice safe, bro. Have you guys ever heard of luxury safes? Neither did we. Well, I guess a super nice looking safe makes sense whenever you're trying to show off some expensive stuff. Fashion mogul Karl Lagerfeld teamed up with German luxury safe maker Dotling to create the world's most expensive personal safe at a cost of $339,000. The design process took nearly two years. The result is a treasure chest that stands nearly six feet tall and is more than three feet wide. Somehow, it has owner recognition technology that allows access to two handcrafted interior cabinets, which pop out from the sides. We're still trying to figure out how that owner recognition technology works. You guys know the answer to this? Let us know in the comments. Unfortunately, only 30 narcissuses were made, and Lagerfeld took one and we doubt he's getting rid of it. So if you really want one, there's 29 of these luxury safes floating around out there. Number 2. Hot Tub Time Machine Maybe this hot tub won't actually take you back in time, but then again, at least it won't bring back any memories, because who's ever really been on a hot tub boat? If you're itching to be floating on water in the middle of the winter, why not do it in a hot tub? This boat's hull is topped with a slated deck, handcrafted from African teak. It's built for up to six adults, and its adjustable thermostat can heat up the water to a max of 104 Fahrenheit. The best part about it? It's electric. This hot tub boat can run for up to 10 hours from an overnight charge. Although we hope it comes with paddles if anyone isn't keeping track of time. The interesting part is that it's steered via a joystick. The thing is definitely made for a party because it comes with a waterproof stereo system that has speakers pop up from the deck. And if that wasn't enough, four ice chests are built into the deck. 
Seriously, how many drinks can six people have in a few hours? Number 1. Not just any red painting How much do you guys like the color red? Absolutely love it? How about loving the color red to the tune of paying millions of dollars for essentially just a red painting? Sometimes I think the art world is just trolling the general public. Back in 2013, an undisclosed buyer bought abstract expressionist Barnett Newman's painting, Anna's Light, for a whopping $105 million. It apparently is considered one of Newman's masterpieces, and it's dedicated to his mother, who passed back in 1965. Interestingly though, the painting found no buyers at Sotheby's back in 1985. It wasn't until a few years later that the Kawamura Museum in Japan bought the painting for supposedly a million bucks. Here's what's next. 